What do you see when you look at me? What? When I look at myself, I see a failure. Someone who tried and tried to become something and ended up failing miserably. You really want to start analyzing your life choices right now? Isn't that what you're supposed to do when you're dying? You don't know that. You're just sick right now. I have HIV, Mary, not a broken leg. You know how many people have recovered from that? Zero. None. Nobody has survived having HIV unless you call the progression from HIV to AIDS surviving. Stop it! You're, you're hexing like... Like a little boy who just found a dead rat. This is your life on the line. You know, my life is nothing, Mary. I am 25 years old, 25 years old, and all I have to show for it is a couple of ex-boyfriends, uh, a few worthless paintings, and now a promise to die a horrible death. You, you wanna know what they originally wanted to call HIV? Gay-related immunodeficiency. They wanted to branch Everyone who got this as an other, some wretched gay who messes up life for the rest of us. It's only when hemophiliacs started getting it that they decided, oh, well maybe we should name it something that doesn't segregate an entire portion of the population who could get this. I mean, what do you think Grandma is going to say when she hears, oh what, did you get a blood transfusion? No, she's going to call me a fag and yell at me to get out of her sight. Really? Well, what about when I said I wanted to be a painter? And she said, oh, but only homosexuals care about art. That if I wanted to retain any ounce of pride, I should be a doctor like Bubba was. Grandma loves you, Isaac. All she's going to care about is that you're sick. Not that you like guys. Not if she knows I'm gay. You didn't live with her after mom died. I had three years of constantly being told that gay people were lesser. Three years of trying to convince myself I was straight. For an old Jewish lady, she has a lot of fire left in her. She's just a product of her time. I'm so sick of that excuse. You can't ignore someone's hate and ignorance because they were born in a different era. People should be able to grow with the times. What? What? <laughs> you are the Westboro Baptist Church's worst enemy. A raging homosexual and a Jew. Yeah, well you're no prize either. <laughs> you know my only regret? Hmm. I'm not gonna be remembered. I'll remember you. I mean, for my art. My passion. I'm never gonna inspire young people or give hope to a lost soul. It's almost far. We should uh, uh, get tea ready. Yeah. Wedding and all. How exciting! How exciting! Yeah, 
and then uh, counting, it's, it's, a, it's a lot of numbers, um, and uh, the painting's good. I, uh, I sent a portfolio to the Met in, in New York. So, oh, well, why didn't you just send it to the, the one over here that we've got, uh, that building, the old bedroom? Oh, the, the SF MoMA. Yeah. <laughs> no, I've, I've already tried them. Oh, I'll go with some tea. I should go help Mary, you know, her with the coordination and three, three cups of tea, huh? Okay. Grandma, um, I have, I have something to tell you. What's the matter, Yakati? I'm dying, Salta. Bob, I am, um, I have HIV. I'm dying. I'm gay. How dare you! How dare you disgrace me! Disgrace your grandfather and your mother! How dare you disgrace this house with your dirty ways! You dirty, filthy perverts! Softa, please, am I no different than our, our people in Poland who are put into the camps? Being Jewish should help you understand that the, the, the oppression I'm facing right now is no different than the oppression our people faced in World War II. You are nothing like the people in the camps. You are a disgrace. Get your fat disease out of this house. Huh? Out! Out! Get out of my house! How can you be like this? This is your grandson you are cursing. And might I remind you, this is his house? You're soiling the name with your hateful ways. You're right, Mary. This isn't my house. And so I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave this house before your fat disease rubs off on me. Isaac, I'm so sorry. I told you! Okay, I told you this was... I'm sorry. This isn't your fault. I just don't understand. How can she just walk away like that? What the hell is wrong with her? Don't you remember, Mary? She's just a product of her time. <laughs> Do you think Mom would have accepted me? <laughs> Mom was a bohemian artist who didn't even know who our father was. I highly doubt she would have judged you for having a boyfriend. Yeah, you're right. Of course I'm right. I'm your big sister. I just feel like I'm in a room and it's shrinking and it's pushing up against me and suffocating me. Then don't let it. <laughs> Excuse me? Don't let it. You, you have some savings, right? A little bit. So use it. Quit your job, paint. Do what you love, travel, make art. Push and push museums and galleries until they pick up your stuff. Come on, Isaac, what, what do you have to lose? My money and dignity. <sighs> Come on, who gives a shit about dignity? And if you run out of money, I'll, I'll send you some. Come on, Isaac, you get to make the most out of your life. Do you think it's grandma? God, I hope not. What hey, is it? The, it's just the mail. This, this looks important, though. No? It's from the map. Open it. No. Why not? It looks official. They wouldn't send it if it wasn't important. No, I just... I've had enough heartbreak for today, okay? Open it. Maybe, maybe later.
Stop laughing! Oh my god! No expression. Stop laughing! <laughs> like that disgrace your grandfather! How dare you! Stop laughing! Oh my god! You're right. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I just zoomed in really far in your crotch. <laughs> I'm so sorry. You, lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>